Good afternoon, my Blanco users. This is Audra with my Blanco, and today I'm going to talk to you about how to use the installation tab and repair tab. So, all right, so we have um, we've had orders, we placed it with the manufacturer, and now the product starts coming in. Um, next thing you want to do is schedule the installation. So um, let's just say I'm going to schedule something for Audra here. So I'm going to go um, to back to my calendar here, and let's say we we got the customer on the phone and um, and let's just say, um, you know, they want to have us install their stuff, you know, tomorrow at 930. So I'm going to go click on 930. I come up here, select that white bar, search up my my customer, select them. Um, put in duration, maybe it's a, a big whole house measure and you're going to need seven hours. Um, then you'll come down and select installation, appointment type installation, and it's going to allow you to, to tie that install to either a PO or an order. So in this case, I did not generate any POs for that order. So it's just giving me um, the option for an order. I select my order and hit done. And I'm going to scroll down here and, and put in some notes for my installer. This is very important. This, Whenever you put in notes on the appointment, it will show up on your, on your contact tab. And I'll show you that in a second. So I just added that appointment on the calendar. It's an installation appointment for my customer. And then that means at that point, it's going to show up in the install tab. So I, I do have to toggle over to orders. It defaults to purchase orders, but you just click that button and you'll see orders. And um, that newly scheduled install is here in this tab. I, I know I got a lot, of, lot in my demo company tab, but I'm going to search up what I just added here so you can see. Here we go. So I scheduled Marion for tomorrow. And this is my installation. So they uh, installers see this much more simplified version here. They don't see the dollar amounts. However, they do see um, the balance due. So, and they see the details of what they're actually ordering. Now this looks the same on the iPad. So a lot of times uh, the installers will be carrying around the iPad. So I'm gonna toggle to the right here and show you what the iPad version looks like. Um, the appointment I scheduled for Marion's right top of the list. And again, this is a just a simplified version of what they're installing. And uh, this from this page, you can actually also create a repair ticket. So um, if one of this, there was an issue with one of these products, you can just click create repair. And this allows you to flag it as either an, a remake or RGA. RGA is maybe there was an issue in shipping. Basically, the manufacturer is going to replace it at no cost or a remake is more, God forbid, you know, we uh, ordered the wrong color or wrong size and we need to get it remade. You can also put in notes for the repair. As you can see, I already have some notes in this example, bring extra tall ladder for install. I tapped on it, I'm gonna show you a secret here. Uh, you can also text um, or talk to text. So I'm gonna click on this little microphone down here Shade came in damaged due to shipping, need replacement. Um, so there, I just added notes. I'm gonna hit create down here. And at this point, I just added a repair ticket right down on the corner. So, um, and now you can manage these repairs much like you would an order. So if I open it up, it allows you to generate a PO that can again, get emailed to your manufacturer if you like or you can you know, manually place the order like you would um, normally. So I'm gonna hit create PO, and then that generates a repair G, um, PO here in the, in the PO tab. Okay, again, it works exactly the same way on the portal version. All right, guys, so that is how to use the installation and repair tab. So remember, um, to have an install ticket show up here on the install tab, you do have to go to calendar, use appointment type installation, tie it to an order, and boom, it's going to show up here. And actually, I just thought of one other new feature we just added. You can actually now uh, create an install ticket 
Um, so if you just want to print something off and hand to your um, installer, uh, you can do that now. And it, and again, just has the install data. Um, and actually, we uh, went one step further here um, on orders. Let me show you this. Download PDF. Let's take a look at this guy. This one has uh, the balance due amount. So uh, you can just, just hand this right to the customer or to your installer. They have the details for the install and they also have um, information on balance due. All right, thank you very much, guys.